Hey there. I am out on this absolutely gorgeous day walking my dog Cedar. And I wanted to take a minute to talk to you about your business blog and why you're not getting the results that you think you should uh, from your blog. Well, if you're like a lot of small businesses, you've got a blog. Maybe you're not sure why you have a blog, but you think, well, we're supposed to have a blog because everybody has a blog. So you've got a blog and you are, uh, you're throwing out content, maybe not on a real regular basis, but uh, you're putting some out there. Maybe you're not sure what you should be writing about, but uh, again, you, you've got some things out there. They're just not getting the results that you think you should. And you hear that blogs are one of the best way of getting yourself known and, and generating traffic and converting leads, which is true. Uh, but if you're, if you're not seeing the results that you think you should, chances are it's a strategy problem. Now, just with, just like business, you don't want to start a blog without a strategy. If you're not aiming at anything, you're sure to hit it, right? So uh, you want to think about your blogging and actually all of your content from a strategic point of view. So uh, there are, think of uh, three pillars or three legs of a stool of strategy. You've got your own business goals uh, that you want to accomplish. You've also got um, the target audience. You need, you need to know them. You need to understand who you're writing to. And then you've got the path that your customer takes from the very beginning through to the end when they're ready to, uh, to sign on the dotted line. And those are the three uh, legs of the stool of content strategy. Now I'll be talking uh, more in upcoming videos about each one of those three pieces, but uh, until my next one, start thinking about who is your target audience? Uh, who exactly are they? What are their biggest pains, their pain points? What are their greatest motivations and what what are the biggest questions that they're asking right now to solve those problems now if you can create content that gets at those kinds of issues you're gonna find yourself writing uh, blog posts that are highly relevant to your audience and they're gonna get a lot more traffic so I'll talk more about that in my upcoming video but uh, you can use that to start get you started I'll see you soon